Hi! Someone asked me to show and explain how I make these, uh, which is like just coloring in a manga page or whatever you wish, you, basically using someone else's line art, um, someone else's blank line art to and put color in it. And since I'm not, it was hard to explain via text kind of, it, it felt easier to show, so that's what I'm doing here. And it's not that hard. I almost feel like I'm cheating when I'm doing it because it's so easy. But let's say that we have um, a page here in my program, which is Clip Studio Paint Pro. And if you don't use this program, but maybe another like Sai or Photoshop, uh, this might vary. But what, what you want to look look after is a, a tool called Convert Brightness to Opacity. And because I am Let's see, now I'm in the layer where I have just put this manga page in and I go and I convert brightness to opacity. It's under edit in Clip Studio Paint Pro and if you can't find it under edit in whatever program you're using, try just googling, searching uh, how to convert brightness to opacity in that program. You might find it, I don't know. Um, but I use this, and, and what's gonna happen when I use this? Let's see. So here I have a brown paint in the background, and as you can see, it's, you know, I just took this page from the internet. It's a um, white background. It's like a scan, scanlation of a mega page. And so how, how do I color this in? Because I want this to be line art. So I go into edit, and then I go into convert brightness to opacity and I make sure that it's the layer that I want to convert and I convert it and <laughs> there you go it's line art now basically and you can do whatever you want with this as if it was your own line art let's see if I have um, I have letter. you can also like change the lines like this wow this was kind of cool i like this color mix and uh, the thing you want to be mindful of is that if you do this uh, the the color will disappear so here i have something that i do with color and if i want to convert this into bright opacity cover brightness opacity it will lose all its colors so let's see I just have, oh, well that one was a different layer, so it doesn't count. But then I can paint it in, but you see, it will turn grayscale, the color will turn grayscale, uh, which is not a problem when you have like this, which is only black and white. Uh, you turn it to opacity and then you have whatever you wish. Let's see, like so. Yeah, you have this, you can make fairly in... You can make Fairlyn wear whatever color you want her to wear, and you can do whatever you want, basically. Um, and yeah, if you want to edit around, like say, let's say I only want, I only want Mr. Dark Magician here. I can just like you know, do this but proper, properly, properly, and uh, say goodbye to everyone around him. And it's but yeah, you know what to do. You know what to do. Well, that's how I do it anyway. And then I just color it in like it was my own picture with paint that I like and colors that I like and uh, that's how I do it. Thank you for listening and I hope this helps. I hope you can do a lot of fun stuff with this. Goodbye!